This video will review a schematic that was created for the Ideal Weight Program, and it'll cover why we gain fat. We know the modern food environment is a major cause of why we gain fat, and there are three reasons why. Because of the high presence of processed foods, food cues, or the availability of food in our environment that we see that triggers our thinking of food, and also highly palatable foods. So how do these things make us fatter? Well, we know that with highly processed foods, we need to take in more calories before we feel full than if we we're eating whole foods. That's right, they offer less fullness per calorie, so they're easy to overeat. And we know that highly palatable foods encourage us, encourage us to take in more calories after we're full. So a good example of this is when the waiter will bring around or offer dessert at the end of a meal and you're full, but there's always room for dessert. And the reason is because we're not eating to satisfy hunger, but we're eating for pleasure. So both of these highly processed and highly palatable foods will encourage us to overeat. Highly processed foods encourage us to take in more calories before we're full and highly processed foods encourage us to take in more calories after we're full. And overeating means that we're taking in more calories than our body needs. We also know that an unhealthy lifestyle, as we'll define here as an insufficient physical activity and insufficient sleep, is also a major contributor to why we gain fat. So how? Well, insufficient activity, for one, decreases the calorie margin that is required for us to overeat, right? So if you're burning less calories, then it's you have to take in less food for you to take in too many calories before you gain fat. And we also know that exercise offers some beneficial appetite regulation. And so without that, it's also easier to overeat. Perhaps surprisingly, insufficient sleep is also a major contributor to why we gain fat. For one, Insufficient sleep will increase the drive for pleasure eating. And so in other words, it makes very tempting, fattening foods more tempting. And at the same time, it makes us more impulsive. So not only do these foods that make us fat look more attractive, but our ability to say no to them is diminished. Additionally, insufficient activity will lead to insufficient sleep and vice versa. Now, an unhealthy lifestyle will contribute to the model because an unhealthy lifestyle in the presence of the modern food environment makes it more likely that we eat the wrong foods and therefore overeat. Now, we also know that the modern food environment will have a negative impact on the fat thermostat in the brain. The modern food environment is implicated in desensitizing that thermostat, enabling weight to rise and also making it difficult for us to lose weight once we do gain it. And in addition, an unhealthy lifestyle is also implicated in this. So both the modern food environment and an unhealthy lifestyle will have a negative impact on the fat thermostat, and that will also contribute to weight gain. And we know other factors will influence fat gain as well. But from a behavioral perspective, it's very useful to focus on the food environment and lifestyle because these are things that lead to overeating. And we know that we're gaining fat because we're taking in more calories than we need. And we're taking in more calories than we need because of these factors. So if you'd like to see our solution to this, please visit us at dansplan.com and learn more about the Ideal Weight Program.